What's up and welcome back to the Crypto Galaxy. Today's live stream focus is my top seven layer one and layer two cryptos to make millions. <laughs> Gonna make a lot of money on these layer ones and layer twos. Well, already making a lot of money. I mean, Neon is pushing the all time highs right now. It just hit $3 again. Just had a wick up to four bucks, getting really close to smashing all time highs. My seven picks include Caspa, Neon, Joystream, Mint Layer, Microvision Chain Space, and a couple more with the clickbait title and the question mark coins. So watch the stream. I'll reveal all my picks later in the stream. So what's up, people? What's happening? I'm very bullish on layer ones and twos. As you can see, they pump a lot when you get big exchange listings on micro caps. Last bull run, I put in 50 bucks to Polygon when it was one cent and it pumped 300x to three dollars and i sold it i sold my whole bag at two dollars after the coinbase listing made like ten thousand dollars on polygon i also made a hundred x on theta i turned 700 bucks into 70 grand i also made a 200 x on phantom another layer one uh turned 50 bucks into ten thousand dollars I'm just saying, man, layer ones and layer twos is where it's at. This is this is the best fundamental of any crypto. Now, I'm bullish on meme coins, too. I'm bullish on gaming, a, a few other narratives, just a few of them. It's mainly the layer ones. And <laughs> Neon is like the pre-bull run. This is, I feel like it's starting the bull run for us. <clears throat> man, I thought the bull run was not going to start until like four months from now. But it's just, it's a bit of a, a early start for this bull run. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty excited for it, dude. You know what? I know that once I start hitting a 40x, let's see, Neon uh, went up how much? 7,400%. Basically like 50x. Oops, hold on. Sorry, 5,000%. 50x. Once you start hitting 50x's, the bull runs here. Like there's no denying it. You don't just hit a 50x in the bear market. In the bear market, you can hit like a 2x, 5x, 7x, but man, a 50x, the bull run is here. So, um, I'm going into full laser focus mode to pack my bags of the best layer one coins, the next neon, the next best micro cap. And I know someone says here already, Shogun says mint layer going strong, a single big exchange. And this pumps more than neon. I would agree. I think it's possible because mint layer is currently at the all time highs. Looks super bullish. Apparently, it's not dumping. So I think this could pump really soon. I made a video on it yesterday. Very bullish on it, dude. The, the chart's bullish. The volume looks good. Who knows, man? Only the insiders know when a big exchange listing, because the reason Neon pumped 5,000% is because of the Crypto.com listing. So all the Crypto.com American retail investor normies <laughs> started pumping our bags for us. And I think it's going to be the same situation with Mint Layer because Mint Layer has a team that worked at USDT Tether and Bitfinex. So they have the connections for big exchange listings. The market cap is only 38 million. So this could make a serious amount of money. Uh, the price prediction I, I would give for Neon best case scenario, um, you know, this can go to 50 billion market cap because it's a layer two. It's a high ceiling. It could hit the top 20 market cap because Polygon was the first layer two to make it to the top 12 or top 10. Then that means Mint Layer can do it as well. It's a similar fundamental. Polygon was a layer two for ETH. Mint Layer is a layer two for Bitcoin. And the Ordinals BRC20 coins have proven that there is interest in, you know, minting NFTs and tokens on Bitcoin. So I think Mint Layer could be the best option, right? So we'll see. So 50 billion divided by... 38 million looking at a potential 1300 x on mint layer so times the price of 51 cents price prediction most optimistically for mint layer looking at a 671 dollar mint layer but keep in mind there's going to be a lot of unlocks for mint layer because of the bad tokenomics it's a 200 million fully diluted market cap so i don't know what the exact schedule is so 671 dollars is pushing it but that's the highest potential a lot of potential for mint layer. So pack your bags, pack your bags. What's up, people? What's going on? Yeah, Miro and Bonk looking like some solid meme plays. Would agree with those. Bob and Turbo are bullish as well. I hold all of them. I bought some more Miro recently. That's a good one too, dude. Looking good. What's up? Water sock back. King Arthur. First. <laughs> You're like 10th. 
do you mean you're first? Get out of here, dude. You didn't know you're first. What's up? Inside info. Mark Odier. I got shaken out of my Yodo. Finally. Dude, that's a horrible scam coin, man. I can't... Do not waste your money on these scam coins, dude. There's, there's no there's no purpose in it. Spend your money on actually, like, good layer one coins and layer twos. Because you know these are not going to just rug you from the insiders right away. Shepard says, hey, CG, just want to wish you a happy new year and shout out to my ultimate member family. Yeah, what's up, man? Happy new years. Do you recommend the, the ultimate tier? Shout out to all you guys. Uh, a few people have joined the ultimate tier recently because... They're like, hey, man, like, you know, I'm just looking to get started with my portfolio. I just found you. I don't know where to begin. Can you give me some help and advice? So if you're looking for, you know, actual advice in crypto, I do recommend get on the ultimate tier because I'll just send you direct messages and, you know, direct contact with me through email. However you want to do it, I'll check you out, check out your portfolio, uh, give you my opinions. I'll, I'll see what you're holding and uh, give you some guidance. So it's going to really help you get started. would recommend the ultimate tier if you... uh. If you want some extra support, just direct messaging with me. Uh, I work. I worked with a few people today already on on Ultimate to to get their portfolios situated, and I'm not gonna name names, but one of them had a whole bunch of normie coins. I had to slap some sense into him, and I think he understands that he is a a normie coin holder. So hopefully he uh, dumps all his big cap normie coins for Caspa. I always recommend Caspa's got to be 80% of your portfolio. Uh, if you want to go super high roller and degen mode, maybe you can go 50% Caspa. Caspa is just the safest blue chip that's in the top of the market cap. And I was, I was telling him, you know, through the DMs to my ultimate member, I was telling him, I was like, man, dude, yes, Caspa is great because right now the rank is 39 and it has potential to fly up through the ranks to, to number three. And that's why I gave a $1 trillion market cap prediction for Caspa. If the whole crypto market cap hits 10 trillion, Caspa can be 1 trillion because that would put Bitcoin at 500 billion. It would put ETH at 250 billion, or, or sorry, uh, it would put Bitcoin at 5 trillion, ETH at 2.5 trillion. And the third place coin, if it's only a third of the size of ETH, it would be close to 1 trillion. So I think Caspa can become 1 trillion. Uh, if we have a good bull market, this bull market, you know, with the EDF approvals and massive institutional FOMO, uh, we, we could see we could see Bitcoin rise faster than anticipated. Right. I, I thought Bitcoin and all the cryptos were not going to pump that much, uh, but I had to raise my Casper price prediction because it feels like the bull run is starting earlier than everyone had anticipated. So, yeah, Casper, you know, is going to fly through the ranks to, you know, number four or five or at least three. And really you don't need many blue chips in your portfolio like big caps because they don't move as much or as fast caspa will though i believe caspa will outperform literally every other big cap it's going to outperform solana xrp cardano avalanche dogecoin polkadot tron polygon Chainlink, tongue coin icp shiba litecoin caspa is going to do multiples of x's like 100x caspa is still 100x from today and all of these other big caps are not going to perform as well. You're looking at 10x, 20x on on the other big caps. So Caspa in a few months is probably going to go from rank 39 to 35, and then it's going to go to rank 30, then it's going to be rank 25, then 20, then 15, then 10, etc. The best coins to make money is the ones that perform better than the others. I understand all cryptos are bullish. I say all the time, oh, this coin is a scam. And someone says, oh, what do you mean it's a scam? It just pumped 3x. You're so wrong. It's like, I guess I'm not, I guess I'm sort of wrong. Maybe it's not a scam. But if certain cryptos are performing, you know, a 10x while something else does a 2x, it, a 2x may as well be a scam. That's a scam return. Certain cryptos just perform better than others. So I know it's, it's really funny when every crypto is pumping a lot everyone gets distracted by all the coins and we think every coin is bullish because everything pumps but everything is just correlated so it takes some laser focus to figure out all right well what's outperforming the market uh clearly some coins like caspa and neon have been outperforming the market and just in general layer ones and layer twos have historically always performed the best with the lowest risk that you have to take because Gaming coins and meme coins are super high risk. They're so easy to make. It's so easy to copy and paste a contract address and be like, whoop de doo here's a new scam coin, Yoto. It's just a token on Solana. I can go make one myself if, if I wanted to, <laughs> but I'm not going to do that. 
It's, it's a horrible scam that people just copy and paste contracts to make new tokens with a new name, a new logo, and then boom. Layer ones, on the other hand, take a lot of work to make. Miro is a beast. Yeah, Miro is an absolute beast. I, I think Miro is one of the better meme coin options at the moment just because look at the narrative, right? It's the dog of Solana. Solana's been pumping and Shiba Inu was the dog of Vitalik Buterin and it pumped, you know, 3,000x. So I think Miro could do another 1,000x. It's only a 20 or 30 mil market cap. It's super cheap right now. Uh, very, very good risk to reward ratio play for, for the current price. Uh, Arion Network, I'm not as bullish on it anymore. I think it's just, it's just pretty mediocre. Arion's not been performing well. Yeah, pack your bags before the having. Pack your bags, pack your bags. Back in my bags. Miro will have staking? Why? It doesn't need staking. <clears throat> Ingenio, Happy New Year. What's up? Arbin, some VIP have given up on ZTX. I still have it. I understand it's long term. It's good, though. ZTX is good. It's a good play. I'm still holding it. I might go buy more. It's pretty good. ZDX, it's a metaverse, so it's going to be high risk, but the, the metaverse is uh, it's going to have a narrative eventually. It's just, it comes and goes. You never know when the metaverse coins are going to pump. Right now, it's all Solana coins pumping. It's um, uh, meme coins are pumping. Just in general, everything's kind of pumping, but you know, certain cryptos like gaming and metaverse are not having a time right now. Let me guess today's show can't ask any questions. Everything is a scam. Buy Miro and anything else I own. <laughs> Do I like secretly change EPT? No, I don't like it. Miro mooning? Yeah, Miro looking good. I know. It's looking great, dude. Crypto Galaxy, the man with organic growth, no paid. Or subscribers here. Yes, sir, Mr. T. What's up, bro? Correct. I do not have <laughs> no paid subscribers. I don't take paid promotions. None of that. Why would you do that? It's just it's just being fake. I don't recommend doing that. Uh, will you drop new buy alerts on your Discord? I will join if you do. Yes, I will. I literally just dropped the buy alert like two days ago or yesterday. So another one's going to come out tomorrow or very soon. Would recommend doing it. Dude. M15, you got to join Discord before I do a buy alert. Before the buy alert, not after the buy alert. Everybody is copying CG. It indicates that CG is the GOAT. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. A lot of people do copy me, which is cool. You know, if I'm giving or speaking information that helps people in crypto and they're copying it, then I think as a whole, that benefits everybody. So I think it's a good thing. As long as people know where, you know, the certain the source or information came from. And even I'm not perfect, right? Like maybe I am one of the best at what I do in my niche category of micro cap, you know, crypto trading. But even then, I, I, I still have a lot to learn. You know, I, I'm not I'm not I'm not perfect either. No one is. Pedro, what's up, dude? In, uh, Indigo, what's the best wallet to use if someone was waiting for Tanjum or one key to come in the mail? Depends which crypto you're talking about. Um, They're all really risky. You can use MetaMask, Trust Wallet, uh, Phantom. Depends which chain you're trying to use. You can use Caspium. It depends on which crypto you're talking about because every crypto uh, has support on different wallets. People in Sepple's chat talking crap about me. Why? Why are they doing that? Like, they're just d digging their own grave. I don't, I don't understand why Sepple hates me. I have nothing against him, but if he wants to hate on me, then fine. <laughs> Give a slap for Sepple. Yeah, who the hell is Sepple? Exactly, exactly. No one knows him. RB, thank you for the $2 super chat. Appreciate the donation. Check out Right Stream. Man, what is this? A crypto for Rite Aid? <laughs> right stream. Wow, that's a really low market cap. Dang, it's got it's got some exchanges. 
chart looks like it rugged, but maybe it's having a comeback. Damn, dude, this is really old. This is a year and a half old. Oh my god. I don't recommend this, dude. What does this even do? I'm just curious. Democratizing the creator economy. Destination for community created an entertainment TV and film crowd. That's that's pretty bad, dude. Uh, RB, if you haven't yet, I recommend check out my video course. Uh, seven really simple steps to evaluate and research cryptos to buy them before they pump 100x. It's just, it's proven to work because it's it's worked already so far with Neon. You know, I'm up 40x. I'm also up like 30x on Caspa. I'm up 20x on Mint Layer. Uh, but crap like this, dude, there's so many red flags. The chart, the age, the fundamental. I haven't even gone into the team or the tokenomics. I don't need to. So if you want to save time with your research of cryptos and just learn how to do it the way I do it, really simple, straightforward, to the point, direct information, how to research coins, 100x your money with the best micro cap, just try the video course. Just do it. Do it. Just do it. The videos course, uh, video course community is is really growing quite well. You guys want to see it? I gotta pull it up. I have a uh, there's a separate Discord chat room for people that are only in the taking the video course, and they're like, man, this is some serious alpha information. Thank you so much for the info. And uh, I'll, I'll pull it up. It's not like there's any super secret information here. So in the video course, it's the separate chat room right here, seven step method, and uh, we've got I don't know, like a like. 10 or 20 people in here so it's a nice little community we share some gems here and there um talk about the research methods i got some pretty pretty kind words about the course so yeah thank you guys so much for those who got the course i'm glad that this is helping you know because where else how else can you find a educational course about micro cap gem hunting I, I i haven't found it man i've been in crypto for like four years i've never found such a thing I don't know, you don't like when we ask what you do think about this and that, but can you look at Sailor? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my gosh, what do you think of this? What do you think of that? Dude, just just get the video course, please, for the love of all that is good. You will learn. You will learn how to look at cryptos. It's so simple. There is a way that it works. Don't you think Casper can only reach that high if smart contract support rolls out? That's not true. Um... Crypto is not actually about what you make. <laughs> it's about what you promise. <laughs> yeah, so just the potential for smart contracts is enough to hype it up and to pump it a lot. For example, look at Cardano. I had bought Cardano in 2020. I put in, I don't know, like just like a thousand bucks. I didn't put that much money in, like one grand. Cardano through the whole bull run, was overhyping everything. They were like, guys, Cardano has the best tech, the best team, the former Ethereum developer, the smart contracts are on the way, and then, boop, it just dumped. However, Cardano did do 50x, so I turned 1k into 50,000, just on the hype alone of the good tech and the potential of smart contracts they never actually finished smart contracts until after the bull run so what do you know the more you learn the better <laughs> you don't actually have to deliver you just need to make false promises well hopefully you do deliver eventually but false promises is enough to create hype so even if it takes caspa 10 million years to finish making smart contracts it's still gonna pump just with the potential alone the idea that it could happen the maybe the potential the possibility the belief <laughs> smash the like button yes please thank you very much smash the like yes bluezilla is a scam electro what's up what's up everything eventually pumps so don't listen to all the scam coins and normie channels that look like "Ooh, i told you so i know they all say that they're all like oh i told you so the only cryptos where i'll have that oh i told you so moment is a crypto that has clearly outperformed the rest of the market which is neon i'm up 40x i turn 1000 to forty thousand dollars in three months this is a crypto where i get to say i told you so but with cryptos like GFAL, I'm up 
10x, you know, cryptos like Mint Layer or, you know, cryptos like Joystream, I'm up 5x, 10x, 20x. I'm not going to brag about those because that's just whatever, right? You can make a 5x, 10x if you just do the bare minimum. The only cryptos you can say, oh, I told you so, is if it outperformed the rest of the market. So it, it you make a good point, Draza. It, it's so true. Young man, CG, I'm in ultimate tier. What's looking like the next crypto to pump? Trying to do short-term trading to reinvest. Back into Caspa. Uh, Miro, if you're looking to take on some risk and get a short-term pump for a lot of pumps. Wow, dude, this is really bullish. Uh, Get some Miro. <laughs> get it now. <laughs> do it. Uh, The chart is really bullish. The fundamental and the narrative is solid. Dang it. My screen just froze because of the stupid Mac update. I'm so upset. Why is this happening? Make your dreams come true. Oh my god, dude. You can look at Shia while I try to fix my technical difficulties because of the stupid camera. I cannot make thumbs ups. This is so stupid, man. Why does this happen? I do not understand. Every time I make a thumbs up, this is like, oh, okay, we're just going to freeze your screen because, you know, why not? Do it! Just Heck. I just added my screen it. back. Where is it? Yes, you can. Do I need to turn it off and on. Just do it. Oh, there we go. All right, let me put my uh, green screen filter back in. Get the chroma key. Stop. Set it to green. All right, and I am huge. And now I'm shrieking. I'm so tiny. <laughs> All right, there we go. Okay, thank you, Shia, for entertaining the audience. All right, let me move myself back. Here we go. Okay, no more thumbs up. Man, all right, so short term, yeah, get Miro, get a little bit. Volume looks good. They're in the process of many exchange listings. Literally just got KuCoin like three days ago, uh, and it's very close to the all-time highs, only about 28% away. Get some Miro. I have a really good gut feeling about this one, dude. I, I put in quite a bit of money. Vung, what's up, dude? Welcome to the live stream. Um... Uh, Tight tanks? I don't know what that is. <laughs> Sponge V2? <laughs> that just sounds like a scam, dude. Are storage cryptos like Arweave worth it? Not Arweave, but if you can find the next Arweave or like a new one, then yeah, I think storage is a okay-ish fundamental. It, the potential is there. It's not like... Like, it, it's, it's got good utility and value, but it doesn't have much hype and FOMO. Cryptos like Layer 1s and memes get a lot more hype and FOMO and a lot more pumps. So, uh, storage cryptos, they're okay. They're just whatever. I, I don't bother with them, but if you want to get some, they're just they're just okay. They're just whatever, man. But don't get Arweave. That's a really old, big cat, normie coin. Uh, artifact, I looked up the team. Uh... I checked their backgrounds. I did not like them that much, but everything else looks good, right? Good exchange listings, good fundamental, good chart. It's new. Just I just didn't like the team. They did not impress me. Something was, you know, throwing me off about them. Red flags. Uh, best cold storage for mint layer, Tanjump or One Key. If you can't find it by searching it, you have to add it as a custom Ethereum chain token. Uh, Vong, joining your VIP soon. Package some coins. And waiting for them to pump. Oh, nice, dude. Yeah, pack your coins, pack your bags. Get on the VIP. Get on it, bro. Get on it. It's worth it. Uh, Salvi, thank you for the donation. Hi, CG. My good resolution for 24 is subscribe to VIP. Made profit with most of your picks since four months. Wow, nice, dude. Uh, can I have your opinion on Maverick Protocol? Cool, man. Yeah, congrats on being up in all the profits. Uh, Maverick Protocol. Let's go see. Yeah, chart looks good. Um, market cap is kind of big for my liking. It's, a uh, 128 million. And also the fully dilution is nine is 1 billion and it's on Binance. Oh my gosh. <laughs> normie alert. <laughs> this is a normie coin. <laughs> Don't recommend this. Yeah, that's a normie coin, dude. It's if it's on Binance already, it's too late. The only cryptos I'm going to buy that got on Binance is like, maybe I'll get meme coins. That's it. Because meme coins have the most pumping potential. So much hype for meme coins. But freaking Maverick Protocol, I can just tell by the name. There's no hype for this. You'll make some money, but you, you won't make a lot. DeFi infrastructure. 
automated market maker. It sounds so freaking boring, man. <laughs> Who wants to buy this? So, you know, it's not bad, but if you want to make a lot of money, uh, there's better options available. I would pass on this. So yeah, would recommend get on the VIP membership. You can see my buy alerts and get uh, access to cryptos way earlier than the public live streams. Would recommend it. Sup, man? Hello from Greece. Have a look at Solo. Eh, probably not. Probably not going to look at that. Yeah, hit the like button, please. Thank you very much. <laughs> I only have four bags. Caspa, Joystream, Miro, and Peppy. Those are good bags. Uh, I'm very bullish on all those. I think all those cryptos are strong buys right now. Uh, I would say Miro is probably the most likely to pump soon, short term. And then after that, it's going to be Joystream or Pepe. And then after that, it's going to be Caspa. That's just my opinion. But yeah, those are all really good, solid plays. I mean, you're looking at 1,000x potential on Miro, 200x on Pepe, 100x on Caspa, 300x on Joystream. They're all like solid. And they all have good tokenomics. You know, you know what I notice? Like they all have really high circulating supplies with... um you know, very good launches without any unlocks that are going to dump on you. Spent hours listening to CG, and I've been in profit ever since. Let's go. Nice, dude. Very nice. How are the ML token unlocks? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. They're not good. <laughs> Virtual Moon, thank you very much. Yeah. Would recommend the course. I don't need the course. I'm happy with the picks on YouTube. That's fine, dude. Like, if you just want to be a, a blind follower of me, I'm okay with it. I don't mind. I think it's better if you learn for yourself. If you want to be your own self-sufficient gem hunter, and you can probably find cryptos before I do or before anyone else. Because once an influencer buys a crypto, um, it's probably pumped. So I do recommend my picks, but my picks are also pumped much more from the time that I found them. So, for example, when I first found Miro... Uh, it was 18 cents and right now it's 40, sorry, not 18, 1.8 cents. Now it's 4 cents. It's about doubled my money. So it's a good buy right now. I will still buy more, but if you want to get cryptos earlier before any influencer, if you want to get them like soon, uh, I recommend the video course because you can figure out for yourself, oh, this crypto looks decent. It's probably going to get picked up by some influencers. And then once the influencers buy them, they're going to pump because the influencers have thousands of people watching and following them. So you can't watch me and follow me. I recommend doing that than doing nothing. But the video course will give you a slight edge um, as a self-sustaining crypto investor to learn it yourself. And it's on sale right now. I, the sale is going to end pretty soon. For, so recommend get the uh, the video course while it's on sale. It's on sale for, for the New Year's. For the first week of the New Year's. ACG, if you like Miro, you might like Kimbo. Dog of AVAX chain. Interesting. Kim, uh, this better have some central exchanges. Otherwise, I'm going to be like, what the heck? Ooh, it does. Interesting. It's got CoinX, LBank, Bitrue. 9 million market cap. Interesting. Uh, I guess I'll keep an eye on it. I'd rather see some more exchanges because if you look at Miro, I mean, they've got tons of exchange listings. This one only has like three really tiny ones. Uh, I'd rather see some more, but I don't know, man. Just throw in some, some uh, small money, see what happens. Uh, Jaber, what's up from Sweden? What's up, dude? Uh, is Butthole Network good? Yes, dude, that is super bullish. <laughs> Butthole network. Get him out of here. Get out. Butthole network. You gotta get on butthole protocol. What happened to your Elon? I sold it. It's terrible. Amazed by your increased price prediction for Casper. Let's see how it plays out. I know. I, I didn't think I was gonna increase it, but you know, the, the bull run is starting earlier than I thought it was, right? It, it's happening right now. The bull run is is happening. So uh, I think crypto could explode bigger than I had originally anticipated just because of the recent pumps. So we'll see, man. We'll see. Don't you think diversifying so much could bite you in the butt? Uh, uh, no. I mean, yes and no. Depends how you diversify. 
Like, if you have most of your money in one good blue chip, that's pretty good. Like, for example, 80% cash ball. If you do that, it doesn't matter how much you diversify 20% of your portfolio because you got to, it's, it's good to diversify the coins that you hold, but not to diversify the money that you have in them, if that makes sense. <laughs> you showed the forbidden thumb. Miro, all in. <laughs> Bought 20k. All in. Change Your Life says, What's your opinion on front fans? Thanks. It seems interesting for adult industries. Probably a scam, but let's go see. Maybe it's good short term. Chart looks pretty bullish short term. The market cap is low. Only has a DEX. That's pretty bad. I don't recommend this. This would not pass my criteria. No way. Not for the fundamental, the lack of exchange listings, nothing. Gosh. Adult industry? That's not bullish, dude. That's not going to be bullish in crypto. One trillion MC got you hyped? Yeah, it's, it, it could happen. Best case scenario, I think Casper goes to one trillion MC. I, I honestly believe it. It can happen, dude. Uh, Boyage, what's up? Got to handcuff yourself to the desk. So you don't freeze? I know, I know. This is crazy, dude. The Mac, yeah, Mac is garbage. Like, what the heck? Why does my screen always freeze? Groot, it's fine. I looked at it. I was not really impressed by the team. The fundamentals there, the exchanges are there. The price is okay. It's okay, man. It's whatever. I, I pass on it, but it has potential. Uh, do you think Miro can be listed on Coinbase? Since Coinbase is really strict on listings. Yes. Coinbase listed bonk. Why is that? Why do you think Coinbase listed Bonk? I'm asking you honestly, because I don't have an answer, but the answer is there. Um, so Miro is the dog of the Solana founder. If the Solana founder is behind Miro, or if he has a friend that's running Miro, or if he knows about the token, and if he supports it, if he gives it his blessing and says, yes, I support this Ponzi coin on my Solana chain. I support the Miro token. If he says that, Brian Armstrong, who runs Coinbase, is going to take notice and they'll have a little chit chat and Brian will be like, hey, so you like this Miro coin, huh? And then the Solana founder says, yeah, bro, it's pretty cool. You know, it's a dog coin made after my own dog. Like, that's dope, right? And then Brian's going to be like, all right, man, I'll just go list it. You know, why not? Sounds cool, right? Because, you know, it's a meme coin and I listed Bonk, so why not, huh? So that's just how it's going to go. It could go down that way. It could not. But the potential is there. And that's why I'm bullish on Miro. Because it could happen. Shiba got listed on Coinbase. Why is that? Shiba is useless. It's a stupid, useless meme token. The only reason Shiba got listed on Coinbase is because Vitalik Buterin was an open public supporter of the Shiba token. Because he was friends in real life with the guy who created the Shiba token, and Vitalik actually has a Shiba dog. So, it's all up to the Solana founder. If he gives his 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 go-ahead and he says, yes, I like this token, it's going to pump 1,000x. Small chance, but the chance is there. I'll take the risk. How much X average do you expect to make the next cycle? I think 100x average. Last cycle, I made 40x average across the board, and that was with no crypto experience. Like, I had no idea what I was doing last bull run, because I was pretty new to crypto at the time. But now with this, the experience that I have, I'm shooting 400x average, maybe 150x. Yeah, AI tech, I looked at it. I forgot what I said. You like Psy? Let's go see. What was Psy? Is that the big cap? Uh-oh. Hey, guys. Normie alert. Bohila is the normie. He likes Psy. It's a 1.9 billion market cap. Run away. Don't touch the normie. Don't touch Psy. It's a normie coin. Mm. Careful, guys. We got a normie in the building. Let's get him out of here. Get him Watch out for the normies. Normie alert. Miro pumped over four cents. 
Yeah, it's already 2x. That's that's crazy good. Uh, Miro store. You can store it on Tanjum. Actually, I just put up a, a guide today in the pinned messages. Let's go. So if you're in my VIP membership, you get the guide on how to put Miro on Tanjum from Mexi right here. Thank you so much to Victor for making this guide. It's absolutely outstanding. Thanks, man. Techwise, thank you for the $2. You still think G Fal is good? Yes, I think it's good. It's great. I'm not selling it. It is very good. You can go buy more if you want. I would not sell Peppy. Hamad, no. Do not do that. Why why would you be a paper you hand? Can act like a man. What's the matter with you? Yes, I am still holding ZTX. Yes, I am still holding area. Yes. Gosh, it's like, if I don't mention a crypto for two days, everyone goes, oh my god, are you still holding it? It's dumping 5%. What's happening? <laughs> it's like, man, <laughs> give me a break. I'm still holding everything. <laughs> I'm not a paper hand. Oh my gosh. How do you figure out future market cap? <laughs> uh, imagination. <laughs> or you get an eight ball. I have an eight ball somewhere. Lee, thank you for the ten dollars and uh, Jesus coin. No, that's a scam, dude. Don't recommend Jesus coin. I'm sick of your crap. Nobody cares about your Ponzi, your Ponzi scam. Stop spamming Jesus coin. Well, if he's gonna donate money, I can't really argue, right? So you you can spam Jesus coin if you keep donating money to me. I'll take it. You know, free donations. <laughs> How long are you planning to have your video course available to purchase? So I'm definitely gonna I'm definitely gonna keep the sale running for the next few days, uh, and after that I'll reconsider uh, from there. So we'll see. So next the next few days should be good. Someone told me I should take it down. They're like, bro, why are you giving out all this alpha on your video course? Because now the secret's gonna get out, and I'm like, oh crap, dude, you're right. So uh, that's why I priced it the way it is, so that less people buy it, so there's a less of a chance and a risk that my information and methods get leaked. So that's why it is where it's at. Uh, hope I don't think it's gonna leak because the people who've been buying the course seem like pretty serious investors who are actually trying to learn crypto. And I don't think they're like spreading the information, right? So I think it's good. I think it's good the way it is. <laughs> Watch your channel for a few days, subscribe to your courses later. Work? Uh, yeah, you can buy the course later it'll still be here today it'll be here tomorrow and the next day and probably the day after that this isn't the bull run tech the previous cycles yes i think you're right thousand bitmaps it's a potential that this is a fake uh start to the bull run it could be we could see a huge correction before the halving or right after the halving because usually the halving is big news like you said the bull run will start having the having dip. So I think you're right. I think there's going to be one more dip or one more correction around the time of the having or right after the having, because that's usually the news that people like to sell. So yeah, I think there will be one more dip. How big will the dip be? I don't know, man. I'm keeping, I'm keeping stable coins and cash on hand just in case there's going to be another big dip before the bull run starts. The bull run will start sometime after the having, maybe not the day of the having, but Maybe a month after the halving, the bull run will officially have begun. <laughs> Chief Fell not doing every anything. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Man, what are you whining about, man? You gotta act like a man. Man up. Oh, Chief Fell's not pumping. <laughs> Miro wants to help homeless dogs. Wonderful guys, saints, let's support the... Who cares? They don't need to support homeless dogs to pump 1,000x, man. Don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to say it's a bad thing, all right? You know, God bless the homeless dogs. They need shelter. They need to find owners, whatever. I'm here for the money, okay? In order for Miro to pump a lot, it needs to get listed on Coinbase. Helping the homeless dogs ain't going to pump my bag. I'm sorry. It's just not. I love dogs. I hope they all find homes, but it's really irrelevant information. It's not going to pump the coin. <clears throat> what should we do by Jiro? Do we wait? 
or a retardment? <laughs> Did you mean retracement? <laughs> a retardment? Oh my gosh. Shrapnel? I think it's bullish. The only downside is that the market cap is big, but um, you know, it's got a good team, a good working game. The chart looks good. I think it's fine. Bonk has an alpha team. Dude, meme coins do not need alpha teams. Why? It's an ex exception. You don't need an alpha team for a meme coin. You just need a meme coin team to have connections to uh the insiders like Vitalik Buterin, Elon Musk, Brian Armstrong, the Solana founder. I guess you could call that an alpha team, but it's not really a team. It's usually just one guy. Bonk listened on CB because the founder was a friend of the CB CEO. Is that true? If that's true, then that explains a lot. And that's really good information. Is that true? I, I think you could be right. I don't know. I haven't looked into it. Dexes are a really bad play because... Um, there's too many of them. It's really easy to make because what happens is that Uniswap was the first DEX and because it's open source code, you can easily make another DEX by just copy and pasting the code that made Uniswap. And then you just slap on your own name on top of it. You just make a little bit of tweaks to the code and then boom, you can make another DEX. You can hire a software developer to make you a DEX for like $500. And then you can buy a logo for 20 bucks. You can make a website for another 100 bucks. It's pretty easy, actually, to make a DEX. I could go make one if I wanted to. Um, so that's not what makes a, a... DEXs are not going to pump because there's too many of them. It's too oversaturated. And the original DEXs are too grandfathered in. Everyone trusts Uniswap the most and one inch the most because they've been around the longest. So it's not really about like how much improvement in tech that you make. It's more like the trust and the adoption. Look at um Ethereum, for example. Really bad gas fees, really expensive. How is it possible that Ethereum is still ranked number two? Surely the new cryptos that are faster and better should have overtaken it, but they're not going to because Ethereum was the first crypto to invent the smart contracts. So it's all about getting grandfathered in when you're in a niche like the DEX. <clears throat> So if you're looking for a good DEX coin, check out um, whatever is the first adopted DEX for a new layer one chain. Like if Caspa comes out with a DEX after they make smart contracts, I'll probably go buy the first Caspa DEX coin, whatever it is. I don't know what it's going to be, but I'm going to watch for it. Crypto Josh. Hey, what's up, man? One of my ultimate members up almost 2x on Miro already <laughs> since your first call. 4,000 profits. Nice, dude. Nice, man. I'm also up in a lot of profit, too. I, I put a bunch of money in Miro. I'm up double. It's, it's looking good. You guys got to check out the VIP membership, and you would have got the buy alert for Miro at about 18, 19 cents. Or sorry, 1.8 cents. I keep saying 18. Dang it. Slap me. You would have got the buy alert for Miro under 2 cents, and you would be up double right now. It's still a good buy right now. I'll I'll, I'll go buy more now. I think it's, it's solid uh, short-term and long-term. I'm just saying that, like, if you really wanted the earlier entries, you know, to double your money quicker, uh, VIP membership is where it's at. Because all the new people are hearing about Miro now after it hit four cents. And it's like, that's fine, dude. It's a good entry. But, you know, you can really make your money go a longer way with um with first dibs. There's only um 900 people in this group. Whereas I have 19,000 subscribers on, on YouTube. So you're basically going to be in the top you know, 5% of people who get into my picks if you're on the membership. So don't be a cheapskate. Do it. Do it. Just, Just do it. Do it. Don't let your dream Good time to buy now with the dips. Yes, it is. I would agree. Good dips. Interlay BRC layer 2 with more features. What is your thoughts? All right, I'll give you my thoughts. Another Bitcoin layer two. Nothing is impossible. Yikes, dude, that dumped a lot. Negative 82%. Oh, it's on some exchanges. It's on Kraken. Oh my gosh, dude, that's a year and a half old. No, no, I don't like this. Here's the problem. It's been out for one and a half years and it only got three central exchange listings. It means it's probably dead. 
the insiders probably dumped all their coins and they quit. Because you can tell if there's no new exchange listings after one and a half years, they're probably done for. Yeah, I, I don't recommend this. Uh, you'll see the price for the course with my first link down below in the description. Just go check it out on my website. Dogs cannot own property. Hence, all dogs are homeless. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> wow. Sorry to tell us EG is getting boring. No new gems. Only pumping his old bags. <laughs> Warning. We got a butt hurt. Mad investor alert. He's so butt hurt. Warning. Watch out, guys. Keep an eye out for this guy. No new gems. Dude, I literally just shared a Miro. Like, it's, an, it's actually a new crypto. Like, what do you expect? Do you expect a new crypto every single day? If you want a new crypto every day, you can go watch Crypto Gains, and you can go fall for all of his rug pulls. You can go buy Elon Christmas. Oh, man. Like, man, what do you expect? Uh, water sock bat. Thanks for the donation. Uh, in the old lady voice. Been waiting 84 years on XRP for 5X. 84 years. I know, it's so sad, dude. All these XRP normies are waiting for the 5X pump. Meanwhile, everything else is bumping. After all the bullish news, everything that's been going on, XRP dropped from 63 cents to 59 cents. <laughs> What an embarrassment of a crypto. These poor XRP normies think they're actually going to be rich. XRP over the last three months went from 53 cents to 59 cents. Over the last three months, my neon went from 7 cents to $3. <laughs> like what? When are these XRP normies going to learn? You got to buy the new cryptos, bro. These, these old crap coins that are big cap normie coins on Coinbase ain't going to make you a, a gazillionaire. I'm just trying to keep it realistic. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah. I'll make a ZDX video. I will. I've got more videos coming out. I'll make one. Thanks for reminding me. Oh, you meant Miro and the retracement. Ah, okay. XRP will 100x. When the Leafs win the cup. <laughs> I don't even know who that is, but they're probably bad. They're probably a sports team who just never wins. I don't know who that is, but I understand. Ben Armstrong had decision to list Miro, am I true? Um, uh, oh, did I say Ben Armstrong? No, Brian Armstrong. Different Armstrong. Brian Armstrong is the Coinbase founder. Ben Armstrong is the, the cocaine addict. <laughs> Diff different Armstrong. Thanks to Suppleman, 90% of my portfolio is XRP. And 10% Bitcoin. <laughs> Casper also solves the trilemma problem like Casper. He can be top 20 easy, I guess. <laughs> You're joking, right? Get him out of here. Get out. There's no way. Uh, Dublin, thanks for the two two uh, euros. Neon, three hundred euros pumped to nine thousand five hundred euros. Here's two for your cut. <laughs> wow, thanks, man. Thanks for the two euros. But congrats, bro, on the profits. That's that's great, dude. Neon looking really bullish, dude. I cannot believe it. It, it went fifty x. I I think it's gonna pump a little bit more. You never know. There could be another exchange coming. And it's very close to the all-time highs, right? Like, just to go from three to four bucks, anything can happen. Yes, look at the volume of Miro. You know it's a bullish sign when you see the volume is increasing like at this rate. Like, at a solid, organic, steady rate. It's a very bullish uh, technical sign that with the volume like that. I, it, it's true, it's true. ZK swap, you know, the chart looks bullish, but it's not listed on any central exchanges, so I'm never going to buy it. <laughs> Do 
you think this bull run will be the first time we see a meme coin hit over 100 billion market cap? Yes, absolutely. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. Uh, inspect the team sucks. I don't like inspect. I don't rec I don't recommend the, the the crypto inspect. The team is terrible. Uh, I'll show you why. Read this. So from the inspect CEO or whoever the heck he is, uh, in his LinkedIn bio, he is bragging about, oh look, 25x ROI for investors on the token launch. Like no, uh, that that's a huge red flag, dude. Do not recommend a crypto that brags about pumping the bags of the pre-sale people. Pre-sale people are going to make money, but if the founder and the CEO is bragging about it publicly, that's just a huge, huge red flag. <clears throat> oh, is it the hockey team? The Maple Leafs? Okay, it's hockey. I don't watch hockey. Uh, XNA team is anonymous, so that's probably a scam. Mm. Yes, Miro looking very bullish. Uh, Ayaz, I think, is another scam. Mm. What is this? Uh, whoa, dude, watch out, guys. Normie alert. Old dino coin. Normie alert. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I don't recommend Ayaz. <laughs> Casper. Oh, Normie alert. Hey, guys, we got another Normie here. Oh my gosh, what's the problem with Casper? <laughs> what's wrong with Casper? All right, Normie, Portos. I'll show you what's wrong. It went down negative 99%, dude. It literally looks like a rug. It's so bad. Yeah, I think MVC Space got some, some uh, potential. All right, so if you want to unbecome a normie and actually learn how to find good cryptos that are not normie coins, uh, I recommend take the video course, seven-step method to 100x your money. It's very straightforward, and it works. I've proven it to work. Uh, first link in the description. Also would recommend if you want to track my trades and join my community, get my buy alerts, uh, get on the VIP membership also with the second link down below in the description. So just do that and listen to the Star Wars music. The Hunger, thanks for the $5 super chat. What the heck? Can't even see it. Oh, I know why. There we go. May Cass be with us. Uh, what's up, CG, CG Ecosystem? Hope we're all ready to moon. Yeah, let's go, Lee Hunger. Let's go, man. The moon is coming. And may the pumps be with you. May the pumps be with us and also the cast ball. Thank you, everybody, for the super chat. Thank you for watching. Shout out to all my VIP members. Shout out to everybody who's taking the video course. Uh, Briscoe Wolf, thank you for the super chat. I bought one mil Miro after your stream. Bummer, I missed Neon. Should be a VIP already. Thanks for the alpha. Yeah, anytime, dude. Thank you for the $50 donation. You, you got to get on a VIP membership, dude. Why, why are you being such a cheapskate, man? Do it. Just do it. Just do it. There are certain things you just can't cheap out on. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Get on the membership. Uh, you would have got Miro at uh, one, 1. 1.9 cents. You would have got Neon at 7 cents. Um, yeah, man, get on the membership. So thanks for the donation and keep holding your Miro. Maybe go buy some more. I'll probably buy some more Miro. It's looking bullish. Water, thank you for the $2. Ben Armstrong is known as the Bleep Bear. All right, thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Uh, I'll see you in the next stream. Peace out.